If I ask you how to uninstall any Android OS, many of you will say, bro, go to my computer, select the Android OS partition, and format it. What? What the f So, if you are thinking of doing something like that, let me tell you that you are wrong. Because doing so will not only damage your system's boot sector, but may also damage your entire Windows. The method I will share in this video will not be found anywhere else on YouTube. And by using this method, you will be able to remove any Android OS from your system, whether it's Prime OS, Remix OS E, or Bliss OS. Now, let's start the video. Let's roll. So, friends, as you can see, at the moment, my PC has two operating systems installed. One is Prime OS, which I installed yesterday, and the other is Windows. I made a detailed video about installing Prime OS recently, so if you haven't watched that video, be sure to check it out. I'll provide the link in the description. For this entire process, we'll need a USB drive with a bootable Windows 7. Even if you're using Windows 10 or Windows 11, the USB needs to be created as a Windows 7 bootable USB. After creating the bootable USB, simply plug it into your computer. Once plugged in, you need to press your computer's boot key multiple times. In my case, the boot key is F12. It might be different for you if you're using a different brand of laptop. In the next step, select the USB storage device and press any key on your keyboard. Here, the loading is in progress, so let's wait for a moment. 2,000 years later. After the loading is complete, press the next button and you will see an option for repair your computer. Simply select this option. It may take a little time for the loading to complete. Once it's done, click on this button and choose command prompt from the options below. Now, from this point onward, you shouldn't skip the video at all because our main work starts here. Whatever commands I provide, you need to enter the exact same commands. First of all, type boot rack space slash scan OS and press enter. Now, you need to type boot rack and press enter. After that, type boot rack space slash fix MBR and press enter. Now, you have to type boot rack space slash fix boot and press enter. Now, you need to enter the last command boot rack space slash rebuild BCD and press enter. After entering these commands, you need to restart your PC once and remove the USB. As you can see, this time, Windows started directly, and it is running perfectly. Now, if you want, you can safely format the Android OS partition. If you don't enter the commands and directly format the partition, you will encounter an error and you won't be able to use your Windows again. So, friends, this was our video today. I hope the video was helpful. If you found this video helpful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. I will meet you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.